Hey there, Chad here for the AI Content Dojo. Finally, it's here. I can show you probably what is uh, what I consider the best, the best way to do IDA or to create IDA for your products and services uh, using AI writing tools that's out there on the market right now. So the way that, yeah, this is just too cool. I'm like stumbling on myself because I just can't wait to show you this. But, you know, just in case that you don't know what IDA is and, you know, what the what everybody else is talking about when they keep asking me how to make shortly do IDA or AIDA, it, it's a copywriting or a marketing formula for writing something that basically takes someone's attention, generates a little bit more interest, gives them a little desire, and then gives them an action to perform to, you know, to take that and, uh, you know, that desire and to purchase a product that you're trying to sell to them. And it's a really good one and uh, it's really cool. And, and I think that, um, it's no wonder that people want shortly to be able to do it. And I can now show you a really awesome way to get Ida copy from shortly for your products. So what I did here is just to kind of show off the power of this. I have three different product uh, descriptions here. Just a little bit of copy that I, you know, sort of put together to kind of, you know, act as an example. And you'll notice Homeworkly, that's my own uh, product. Well, is it a product? It's a website. But I want to see how Ida runs on it too. Before I begin though, if you like the content on this channel, please subscribe and please share. Your sharing will help grow this channel and, and allow me to continue doing this and do better in the future for you and uh, expand into more tools and all kinds of different things to help us create content using AI or even just being more productive without AI. Just that's the goal of the AI Content Dojo. And if you support this and you enjoy this and, I'm, and you find what I do helpful, please share, like, you know, subscribe comment to help me beat the algorithm all that kind of stuff i really appreciate that so ida i know that this is you're just gonna oh you're gonna freak out about this so okay i have three different product descriptions but imagine that you work at a company that has a whole bunch of products and you put all the products into one shortly here and you separate them by the triple slash Remember, the triple slash is the cutoff for the context. So you basically, with the triple slash, you kind of separate it into its own sort of section of the of your document here. And um, I've already got the command in my in my copy, so I can paste it in. And when you see this, I think you're just gonna be really impressed. Like I said, imagine that you're at a company, you've got a lot of product reviews, or not product reviews, um product descriptions that you want to create some IDA copy for to present to your marketing team or something like that. And you paste all of them into one document like this. And then you do this, please write an IDA for the above. Basically shortly's big brain knows what IDA is now and says, Hey, I recognize that you're going to want a specific type of copy. And it's for the content that's above this instruction. Now, that's one of the superpowers of the instruct command. If if you've watched a, a recent video I created that kind of describes the context and like how the, it works in shortly, the instruct command is special because it does not use the title and it does not use the article brief. You can leave that completely blank and you can leave this completely blank if you want to. It uses only what's he, above it. So from basically here up and what's inside of the square brackets. And so this is going to create IDA copy for the paragraph above it, which is a description for an outdoor gas grill. Let's let it run, see what happens. And watch it just blow up and go, no, no IDA, no IDA for you. <laughs> uh, here we go, Ooh. here we go, very nice. All right, good. It's going a little bit long. It's probably going to cut off here. Yes, it does. Okay. So when you see this, when it gets to the end, and it, this is a very good copy, when it when it gets to the end here and it kind of stops, well, there's a limit to how much that open AI, AI will allow the AI to return. And so you have to finish it or use the AI to finish it. You could probably just hit right from me right here. And in fact, you know, if you go here, maybe copy 
Well, you probably wouldn't want to copy this into here because it already has that context. Let's just see what happens. It might finish it, probably, but it's probably going to go on and on a little bit too long. But you can clean that out. Oh, it did a pretty good job. Excellent. So there you go. There is the IDA for the grill. All right, your next product is there, and you boom, run. This one's for a puppy chew toy so they don't chew up all your furniture while their teeth are growing. And, uh, yep. Mm. Boom. Look at this. It's just so cool watching it write that because, you know, you're just, it's so on point. Shortly has really taken some big strides in the last couple of days, uh, growing smarter for to help us, you know, make some more, uh, more on point content for our marketing needs. Shortly has always been really good for just kind of cranking out long form content for blog articles or, or writing, you know, fiction, creative stories and stuff like that. And now it can do better marketing material for you too. And let's see what happens with something like this that's like totally kind of. Well, I guess work from home is isn't really totally out there, but let's just see if there's a if there's a way for it to get Ida from that. But I think you can see the power in this. It's all happening in one document. I don't have to jump around between forms, bounce all over the place. I can get everything here in one. And if I could get all of my like if I had a ton of products to work through, you know how fast you can get through this? It's just a huge time saver. And I think that you're going to be totally impressed with this. Um, I am, and I and just, it's awesome. So, as you can see, the shortly way is you just ask, right? That's literally what I'm doing here. You know, if um, you go to the bottom here, just like in some space. But the instruct command in shortly is as if you turn to your AI assistant, your AI writer, and you go, please write an IDA for the for the above which is essentially saying please write it in, in ida for home workly for those who want to get the most out of your work from home time research tools and gear reviews productivity advice lifestyle articles new developments in tech to make sure that your work from home time is spectacular and when you tell the ai to write about that and it comes back with something like this for you that's a massive time saver for you i think and uh, i hope that you're impressed by this as much as I am. And I wanted to also give you a little bit of a sneak peek of was of something that I have in the in the works where I'm I'm trying to build a little something special for people who want to consider supporting the AI content dojo a little bit more. And um, it's going to be something around providing a really great interactive reference material that you'll be able to fine tune for your needs. Um, a little hard to guess by that, but it's going to just be a nice way for me to give back to members who want to provide a little bit of extra support for the dojo as a huge appreciation for everything that you guys have done to get me where I am so far. As little as that seems, you know, four or 500, uh, going on over 400 um, subscribers on the YouTube channel, uh, is is a big deal, and I, it sounds like a little, but you got to start there. And I, you know, I never would have imagined that I'd have like fourteen hundred, like one thousand four hundred something watch hours in the first two months of of launching this, and and four hundred subscribers. You out there who give me your attention, thank you so much. And if you're not in the the Facebook group yet. Do a search on on uh, Facebook for the AI Content Dojo. I have a Facebook group where we're all just really helping each other make the most of these tools. And thank you for your time. Until next time, take care.